Hi, everybody, and there is a lightning warning here in the area. We're in Tampa Bay as the lightning are ready to strike. And we are about set to drop the puck on this one. The Canucks win the draw, and they'll start on the attack. The points take over on possession. And now he moves it quickly to Hedman. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Gensel. Good defensive stop at the poke check. Vancouver's on the attack. And that's stopped away by Radish. Carries the puck through the neutral zone. Takes a shot. Oh, what a save with the glove by Demko. Lots of time left in this period. Still no score in this one. And they win the faceoff and set up to go on the attack. Demko's going to hang on for a whistle. And they win the defensive zone faceoff. Scrum ensues along the boards. Tampa Bay's got the puck. Now a quick pass to Hedman. Oh, how did he stop that one to save by Demko? Demko's going to hang on to the puck for a whistle. Miller's won the faceoff. Moves the puck. Steps across the blue line. Here's a shot. Blocked from someone in front. Moves the puck down low. And that's intercepted by Gensel. Carries the puck inside the neutral zone. And he slides it quickly to Gensel. He scores! to that puck and when you skate onto it you have some speed you can get that shot off the way you want and he capitalizes perfectly the Bulls have to be feeling good about themselves they have been pushing and pushing to start this one James they're emotionally charged as they're at home they're playing their opponent and they started right from puck drop and that emotion was transferred and channeled into their feet because they've been all over the ice with their legs under them Jostling for the puck, but still maintains possession. Gains his own along the right wall. Can't stay on his feet after that hit. Can't hang on to the puck after taking a knock. And he gets just enough of it to keep it out for the back of the net. Vancouver's got it across the line. Here's a shot. Oh, what a great stop as he got a piece of it with the glove. Lots of time left in this period. Tampa Bay's ahead, 1-0. Well, that's one way to win the draw as he skates away with the puck after the two centers were tied up. Tries to the crease, and the puck banks off the bump. The Canucks have it now. Along the side, here they come through the neutral zone. Tampa Bay's got the puck against the boards. Vancouver's got a hold of it against the wall. Centering feed! Couldn't complete the pass. Joshua's gaining momentum. And he slides it quickly to Garland. Club save, and he made it look simple. And they'll cover it up, forcing a stoppage in play. The Bolts have the shot advantage. And they also have the lead on the scoreboard. Shooters won the draw. Makes the save on the slapper. Feeds the puck to Atkinson. Tampa Bay's got it in the offensive zone. And that's broken up. 
Vancouver's got the puck in the defensive end. Poked away in the offensive zone by Hagel. Oh, he gets in front of that to make a great save. And it's a quick pass to Heinen. Knocked away with the stick by Sheary. The Bolts gain control of the puck against the wall. Tripped up on the play, and the referees caught that one. And let's see what the call is. Well, it's kind of hard to protect a one-goal lead when you're sitting in the box and your team's short-handed, James. The PK unit's going to have to find a way to stave off the power play here and get the job done. Well, this gives us our first chance to take a look at the team's power play unit. Power plays are a funny thing, especially when you're down by one, James. You have to act as if you are the hunter, and you have to possess that puck and attack. The Canucks have it now. Here's a shot. Comes up with the stop. Nice poke shot. Here's a chance to get it out of their own end. Oh, they telegraphed the pass, and he picks it off. Tampa Bay has been working hard away from the puck, and they're using their awareness to take away angles and seams. And this is something they're doing with their stick positioning. Coach talked about it pregame, how important it was going to be. Picked off in the offensive end. The Canucks ready to go on the attack. The Bolts will kill off a few extra seconds now. Shot! And he keeps that one out. Looking to break out here on the power play. Cuts to the front. Stopped by the goaltender. Taken along the wall by Glenn Denning. And now he moves it quickly to Gergensen's. Fired into the offensive zone, and they'll make some changes. Now a quick pass to Hughes. Along the right side into the offensive zone. And he slides it quickly to Hughes. Oh, great read as he pokes it away. And that's knocked away. Cuts into the paint. Can't maintain possession. Oh, he just got enough of that to keep it out. The Lightning have gained control of the puck along the wall. Trying to get something going here with this man advantage as they start from their own end. Deflected away. Nice defensive use of the stick there. Cut down by Pedersen. Went for the dirty game, let it go sideways. Well, he's got such a slick set of hands. He's trying to manipulate his opponent one by one, but he tries one too many, James, and he loses the puck. Easy mods almost back on the ice. Tampa Bay's penalty killers get a hold of it. Vancouver's got a hold of it along the wall. Tampa Bay's lead is still intact after a solid effort by the penalty killing unit. Well, often in hockey, we say timing is everything, and when you're down by a goal and you have an opportunity on the power play, you have to cash in, and the whole bench knows that that was a missed opportunity. Handles the pass. Puts it on net. How did he stop that one? Does a great job with some great pushes to get to the top of his crease and make the save from a high-danger area. We haven't even hit the midway mark of the period. Tampa Bay's up one zip. Play resumes as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. Denies them in close. That's a great save, but the goaltender had to get out to the top of his crease, take away all the ice, and make himself as big as possible. Looks like lineups are set, and they're ready to get things back underway. The Bolts win it in the defensive zone. Oh, 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 somebody get the smelling salts after that. Some players get into the game by physically engaging early. There's a fine line there, but that was executed perfectly. Let's it fly. Oh, what a chance wide. Well, this is frustrating, James. You do everything to get to the right position. You put yourself in a great A scoring area, and then you miss. That's frustrating. Here's a feed in front. Another pass. There's the whistle. We'll get a face-off after the goalie covers up. 
Face off coming up here and Cheryl. Let's see if they can keep that momentum going. No question about it, James. We know where the momentum lies right now after some sustained pressure. Heavy pressure, heavy forecheck. Lots of shots going to the net. The goaltender is fatigued. You want to make sure that you can continue to apply that pressure and see if you can squeak one by. The Canucks take possession of the faceoff. And that carries off a body in the lane. Goaltender hangs on for the whistle. Still a lot of time left in the period as we approach the midway mark. We've got a 1-0 hockey game thus far. Offense is on faceoff and he wins the draw. Can't hang on to the biscuit after that. Esimont's got the puck. Some solid defensive work in their own end with the poke check. Vancouver's got a hold of the puck. Spectacular stop by the goaltender. How did he hang on to that? I love how impressive he plays the shooter on the inner slot here, James. He knows that he's got to take away the net, so he gets out and challenges to make the save. Teams are ready to go, and we're about moments away from puck drop. Tampa Bay is counted, and they're on the attack. Passes it over. Chris shot from the slot. Gives them nothing in front. Slides the puck to Hughes. Vancouver's going on the attack as they gain the zone. The Lightning have gained control of the puck in their own zone. Esimont's going to play it against the half wall. Strong's been tripped up, and we got a penalty coming up here. Big hit, and that frees up possession. And he sprints to the bench to get the extra attacker out on the ice. Here comes the call from the official. Well, this is a critical juncture of the game. You've got the one goal lead, and now you take a penalty. The PK unit has to be the task and kill this off. The Canucks once again send out their power play unit. Well, they earn this a power play, James, through hard work, and it's an opportunity to even the score here. They need to find a way to execute and get back to the even score. And that's off a stick. Clear it, clear it. Trying to come up with a huge defensive play to get this puck out of his own end. Sends the pass over. Tenacious battle for the puck along the wall. The Bolts have it against the wall. Pokes it away in his own end. Garland's lugging the puck. Still keeps a hold of it. On the attack into the offensive end, right up the back. The Lightning have the puck shorthanded. Oh, these home fans have had enough. They're wondering when a call's going the opposite way here, Cheryl. You can hear the frustration right now with that third call in a row, I might add, James. I mean, this is a one-sided game, isn't it? Unbelievable. Here we go, a lengthy five-on-three power play looms. With a long five-on-three, yes, you have more time, and you know that you've worked on this in practice. Coach wants you to be patient with the puck, but they want you to find an opportunity to drive and attack. You have to move it, or you have to fire it. The Bolts get a hold of the puck under man. Vancouver's got a hold of the puck now. Sensational stop by Vasilevsky. Well, he makes an incredible save on a point blank shot here, James. I love the way he's aggressive, he's competitive, and he wins the battle. Suitors at the faceoff dot, ready to win this draw on the man advantage. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Scoops up the puck. Oh, there's a collision that knocked him off course. He wasn't expecting that one, James. He had his head down, unable to brace himself, and his stick goes flying. Now he's got to go collect it. And now he angles it across to DeBrusque. Pass back to the point. Here's a chance! What a close save by Vasilevsky! Hagel's recognizing they're still shorthanded here as they get ready for the faceoff. 
Miller's won the faceoff, and now let's see what they can do. And he makes the save. Coughs it up on the play. Vancouver's got the puck along the wall. Redirected in front. And the puck stopper hangs on to get a breather here for the team. Just moments away from the resumption of this power play. They're ready to drop the puck here for this faceoff. And off the draw, they win possession. Here's a chance to clear the puck from his own end. And they get it out. The Canucks take it along the wall. Quick feed to Besser. Tampa Bay's looking to break out. Good clearing attempt to breathe. Vancouver's got the puck along the boards. Into the offensive end, right up the middle. Quick shot! Puck is frozen, and we'll get a faceoff. Sorelli's ready for the draw as they continue to be shorthanded here. Nice job tying up his opponent. And the goaltender grabs that one for a whistle to try to slow things down here. Another big face-off looming as this power play rolls on here tonight. The Canucks win that offensive zone face-off. Vasilevsky's got the puck and he's going to hang on. The Canucks have had plenty of looks here to start this one, but they still trail in the first. Vancouver's won the face-off. The Bolts will try to shave a few seconds off this penalty now. Here they come up along the wing. Pesimov's out of the box, but they're still short-handed as he steps in to help try to kill off this penalty. Slides the puck over. Oh, and he just misses. What an opportunity there. Well, just is a big word, James, because when you have an opportunity like this from a primetime scoring area, you have to finish it off. He doesn't even hit the net. Chernak standing up, ready to go. And a great read to turn that play aside. Here's a chance to get it out of the zone shorthanded. And a big kill keeps the one-goal lead intact. We're back to even strength. Sometimes when you're up by one and you get a call again, you can sit back on your heels and, and really allow the PP unit to take advantage of you. But not this group. They attack it at all lengths. Good job by them. There's the whistle as the puck is frozen up. Inching closer to the midway mark of this period, the Bolts have taken a 1-0 lead. They win the faceoff here in their own end and take possession. Nice stick work to knock the puck loose. Oh, look at this. Moves it quickly over to point. Levels him with the hit. And he loses control of the puck. Gaining speed through center, and here they come on the attack. What a glove save by Vasilevsky. And the centers glide towards the dot here as we got a face-off set to go. Points won the draw here in their own zone. Tries to make that cross ice speed. And he slides it quickly to Gensel. Vancouver's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Joshua's taking it from his own end. And he takes the dish. From the left side, they gain the zone. And that's knocked away. Tampa Bay's got it in their own zone. Vancouver's got possession of the puck. Turned aside with the glove by Vasilevsky. In front and a stoppage on the play as the goaltender covers things up. Vancouver's had plenty of good looks here so far in the first, but they still trail. And they win the offensive zone faceoff, and here we go. Takes the puck at the point. And it's a quick pass to Hoaglander. Slides it back to the blue line. Under siege and finally grabs that one and covers up for a whistle. More than half the period has gone by. Hope you're enjoying this one. The Bolts lead it 1-0. Vancouver's won the draw. Into the offensive zone down the right wing. That's loved by Demko. 
We'll get a face-off after the puck stays covered up. Vancouver's got the puck after winning the defensive zone face-off. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. Shot! save, and the play continues. Keeps a hold of the puck after that knock. And now it's grabbed by Sheary. They've got the defense outnumbered. He got all that hit. And that's blocked in traffic. Handles it along the blue line. Puck scooped up by Miller. Moves it to Besser. Skates to the crease. Oh, a clutch save. Man, does he ever put a clinic on in shielding the puck and puck protection? You can try and knock him off the puck, but when he decides to get position on you and get that wide stance and lower that center of gravity, you're in trouble. The Canucks cross the blue line and are on the attack. Here's a centering pass. Oh, and they couldn't complete that. Vancouver's got possession here in the offensive zone. Oh, he kind of struggled with that one, but he got just enough to keep it out. Inside the offensive end, now down the left. Puts a little mustard on the hit to knock the puck loose. He says, let's get physical on that play. Puck moved over to Myers. And now he moves it quickly to Sprong. Moves the puck into the attacking area. Vancouver's got the puck in the corner. Tape to tape feed on the blue line. Here's a short pass to the breast. Makes the save. The Bulls gain possession. The Canucks have it in the offensive end. Up along the wing. Quick feed to point. Uses the force on that hit. The Canucks played along the boards. The Bulls gain possession along the wall. And now it's over to Gensel. Fires it on net. Oh, and it stays out. He got a piece of that one. Knocks the puck loose. Tampa Bay's got it in their own zone. Fires it. Stopped by the goaltender getting a piece of that one. Takes the feed at center and moves up ahead. Great heads up play with the stick by Pervix. Vancouver's got the puck. Reaches out and scores! And we are back to even! Yeah, tie game now, James. I really like the energy that they've showed throughout the game, but now it's about channeling the energy they've just created and doing something with it. Well, it's gonna be a quick release that gets it done here, James, but I'm more impressed with him getting to position. You gotta fight to get to those areas. It's tough in there, you pay the price, and because he does, he scores a goal. More than half the frame has been played here. You can feel the energy in this crowd. It's a tie game. The Canucks win it. At center ice now. He grabs the puck. Let's it go. And that's poked away in the offensive zone by Garland. Vancouver's gained possession along the boards. A little bumping around, but still maintains possession. Stones him in front. Puck is frozen, and we get a stoppage in play. Centers are set. Face off, ready to resume play. Bluegers won the face off here in the offensive zone. Denies him. He got all of it. The Lightning have possession along the boards. Tampa Bay's got the puck along the wall. Oh, how did he keep it up?
Tampa Bay's gone in front by a goal here in the first. Well, I really like the way they've competed here, James. They get the go-ahead goal, but they got to find a way to continue to attack. you got to play with killer instinct, especially when there's so much time left. And just like that, from out of nowhere, comes up with the puck. The Bolts play it along the boards. And he dodges the poke check there. And that goes off someone in front and doesn't reach the net. The Canucks will play it in their own end. On the attack along the boards. That's blocked. Stopped by the goaltender. And that's some great pressure in the offensive end by Hoaglander. Hedman's taking it from his own end. Up the neutral zone now. Tampa Bay's got the puck against the half wall. The Canucks have it now. There's a firm collision. Quick pass to SMO. And that's snapped away in the defensive end by Hoaglander. Quick feed to Radish. Takes the puck deep inside his own end. Moves it quickly over to SMO. Shot! Oh, solid save by Demko. Great positioning by the goaltender to redirect it to the corner, getting it out of danger. And that's deflected off someone in front. The Lightning have the puck against the boards. Just a little too much contact and couldn't hang on to the puck. Right up the gut into the attacking zone. Tried to make a move and the puck hops away. Fessler is trying to get a little too fancy with the puck there, and as a result, he loses it. Takes a shot. Stones him with the blocker. Beautiful feed up ahead from the right wing side. Quick pass across to Gensel. A spirited battle along the boards for the puck. And that one's picked off in the neutral zone. Tosses it on to Pedersen. The Canucks have it now. Myers takes it into the offensive zone. The Bolts scoop it up along the boards. Tampa Bay's got it along the wall. Takes it up, but he's still got the puck. Sends it quickly to Pedersen. Takes a shot. Oh, he gets a piece of the puck to deny them there. Moves it to point. Grabs control of it at the point. Let's it go. And he comes up with a stop there. Just here in the late stages of this frame, Tampa Bay's got a slim lead. They lead it 2-1. Points won the face off deep inside the offensive zone. A shot! There's a save by Demko. And they'll get a breather as the goaltender covers it up. The Canucks would love to even things up before the end of this period as they trail despite being the busier team in the shots department. Taken by Forbor. Vancouver's got a hold of it along the wall. Throws one up to Garland. And he coughs it up with the pass. The Canucks get a hold of the puck in their own end. Looks to set up at the point now. Oh, what a save! He plucked that one! Goaltenders work so much on their reaction time, and man, this is just a clinic right now as he flashes the glove and makes the save. Teams are ready for the draw. The linesman about to drop the puck. Points won the draw inside his own end. Right through center and into the offensive zone. Takes the feet at the back end. Oh, tremendous save on the play! What an incredible save. No idea how he got to that one, James. And the shooter is absolutely stunned. What a stop. Oh, well, a save like this, it'll wake up your entire bench. I mean, this is a game changer, James. Talk about changing the momentum of a game in a timely save. That's one right there. Get a hold of the puck in their own end. Moves it over to 
to Sherwood. The Canucks are on the attack. Here's a shot. Big stop right there. Oh, what a hit against the boards. Executed perfectly, James. I mean, well, you can't do that or you're going to find your way marching over to the box. Penalty coming up here. A tough penalty to take as you're looking for the equalizer. You're in a one-goal deficit, and you got to find a way to generate offense, James. Real tough one to take. Tampa Bay sending their power play unit out for the first time tonight. They're getting their first power play opportunity in the game, and here comes the top power play unit in the league. They're so dangerous and effective. It is extremely difficult to fend against them. Made the stop on the play. Pop clear from the defensive end. Tampa Bay's got a hold of it against the wall. Can't get a hold of that pass. And now he moves it to Paul. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Denied by the goaltender. Made that stop. And he loses control here. And a great save. Brings the puck into the offensive end now. And that pass is redirected. Now a quick pass to Sorelli. Big pass speed. There's a shot. Denies him in front. That's a fantastic save by the goaltender, but his team has to do a better job of protecting the middle of the ice. Those high-danger scoring chances eventually go in. Points looking to win this draw and this man advantage here. Bluegers won the draw here in the defensive zone. Nice play, shorthanded as they get control of the puck. Along the right wall and into the offensive end. Here's a short pass to Kucherov. Tries to get this man advantage going from their own end now. This is it off. And some textbook body contact there. Trying to clear. And the puck clears the zone. That's why you want players with active sticks on your PK, James. They can close quickly and they can corral the puck and just fire it down the ice. Cross-corner dump in. The Lightning have taken possession along the wall. Hedman's moving the puck through his own zone. Takes it into the slot. Oh, denies them with the paddle save. Still some precious time left on this power play as they get set to drop the puck. The Canucks win the draw on their own end. And he takes the feed. Getting a little physical out there, but still holds on to the puck. Tampa Bay's got a hold of the puck now. The Bolts take it across the line. Feeds it over. Stopped by the goaltender. And he slides it quickly to Sorelli. Oh, it stops him again. Well, he has been under siege, and I'm loving his compete level. I mean, he's making consecutive saves one after another. Power play continues with this offensive zone draw. Well, yeah, they have a numbers advantage, and they also have the advantage that the goaltender is extremely fatigued. They gotta drive the net, James. Puck picked up by Radish. Slides it across. Brings it off the pipe. The Canucks PK unit delivers on that. Well, that's just a great sequence of events with that power play unit. The way they were moving the puck, the execution with their passes and the scoring chances that they did get. Hey, sometimes it doesn't go in, but if they continue that, you've got to figure their numbers are going to go up. Sorelli's got the puck, and they'll go on the attack. Picked up along the boards by Hagel. The cannon from the point! Big time stop there. Susie's letting the puck. The Canucks cross the line and gain the zone. Quick pass to Chernak. And he slides it quickly to Hagel. Slides the puck to Atkinson. And it's a quick pass to Sorelli. Both sides digging in for that puck along the wall. Taken along the wall by Pedersen. And he takes the feed. Oh, what a save with the glove! Both teams readying here for the face-off. Basta, basta. 
They take possession as he locks them up off the faceoff. Vasilevsky's going to give everyone a chance to breathe and hang on to the puck. Miller's won the draw, they're on the attack. Oh, stick save and a puke! Vasilevsky's made a great save, and even better as the redirect to the corner. Streaking into the attacking zone for the right. People excited as this opening period comes to an end. One of the all-time great rock acts from the 80s getting set to play here for these fans. And we'll catch our breath. Back with more in a moment. Face-off here in period number two is about set. The second stanza is underway as the puck is dropped. Let's go. Swatted away with the stick in the defensive zone. Picked up along the wall by Radish. The Bolts are in transition. Slides the puck across. And makes the save. Oh, scores! Oh! it in for the goal. to pull this geek off, James. When you move it to the forehand, you got to outweight the goaltender, and they're so athletic today that they can move across the crease so fast. But he does a fabulous job with great patience and buries it. The Canucks have even things up here in period number two. We got ourselves a new game. Yeah, you love these games that go back and forth, and they've worked hard to get to this point, and now they got the equalizer. Giddy up. Puck grab by Horonic. Good heads up play in the defensive zone. Hangs on to the puck after taking a hit. Receives the pass. Takes the pass. The Canucks have it from their own end. From center, they get into the attacking area. Caught, makes the save as that goes off the glove. <laughs> Lots of time left in this period. We are all tied up in this one. Tampa Bay's got a hold of the puck. And now he moves it quickly to McDonough. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Kucherov. The Canucks get a hold of the puck. Slides it over with pace to Pedersen. Picks up the puck in his own end. Scooped up along the wall by point. Puck sent over to Kucherov. Moves it around along the half wall. Puts it on net. Stopped by the goaltender. There's the whistle as the puck stopper elects to hang on. Both centers ready to take the draw here coming up. The Canucks win the defensive zone faceoff. Slides the pass over to Strong. Shot! And there's the save! Goaltender covers it up. We get a whistle to slow things down. <laughs> Vancouver's won the draw. They'll go to work. The Bolts will play it from the defensive zone. With some open space at center. Excellent stick work on the play. Passes the puck over to DeBrusk. Quick feed to Pedersen. Here's a chance. Oh, gets a little piece of it and keeps it out of the net. 
Grabbed along the boards by Pedersen. Shuts him down. Pedersen's made an incredible play right there. I mean, he's stumbling. He looks like he's going to fall on those, but he's off balance, and that's the key. The puck isn't exactly where he wants it, but he still manages to find a way to get a shot off. Great post by Garland. Rips it and rips it. And the Tendy's going to hang on and get a whistle here and a reset. Much needed one at that. Oh, yeah. I mean, they have just been taking control of in their own zone, James, and they needed this reset. They needed the goaltender to pounce on that puck. They can all collect themselves and get a line change. The Bolts take possession off the faceoff. Can't hang on after that hit. along the wing. Moves the puck along the half wall. Passes it over. There he is from the slot. Oh, trapper save by Vasilevsky. What a save from point blank range. I mean, he's in fabulous position, square to the shooter in the slot, and he makes the glove hand save. We're still in the early stages of this period. It's all tied up. The Bulls start with the puck in the road end. Takes the feed. Dishes it off. Quick shot. Makes the save with the trapper. Both teams are set. We'll drop the puck here. Miller's quick stick off the draw wins possession. Oh, big time hit along the wall, and this is why I'm glad I'm up here in a suit, Cheryl. And I'm right there with you, James. I wouldn't want to be along those boards either. It almost looked like he left his feet early, but nonetheless, it's a bone crusher. There's another stop. What a sequence. I mean, he has been outstanding making consecutive saves. I mean, his defense, they got to start playing. The Canucks win the draw. Tampa Bay's got the puck. In all alone, on the breakaway! The Bulls are finding that little extra pep in their step here in the second period and have taken a one-goal lead as a result. Well, they break the deadlock, and that's huge. Now you're playing in front, but I think this face-off and the shift that ensues is critical, James. Now you got your opponent right where you want him. You're back on their heels. Take advantage and try and get another one. Aims the zone along the right wall. Shot! The Canucks get a hold of the puck along the boards. Sends a pass over. Takes the feed up ahead. And a stiff break set up. The Bolts take it along the wing. Takes the feed at center from the right wing. Vancouver's looking to break out of their own end. Now a quick pass to Susie. Here they come inside the neutral zone. And he hangs on to the puck. Too many bodies in the way. Takes a spill onto the ice and loses the puck. Scores! I got two! Yeah, it certainly is, James. And who's going to come out on top by the beginning of this face-off? You want to be able to get that puck in the offensive zone and find a way to continue to attack. I hear coaches preaching all the time, take away the eyes of the goaltender. What does that mean? It means you get yourself in front of that net, whether it's a double stack, a double screen, whatever you can do so that the goaltender can't find the puck. And he couldn't as he drops to that butterfly. He tries to make himself as big as possible, but he can't catch up to the puck. Lots of time left in this period. 
We got a tie game. Tampa Bay's won it. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Forces the turnover. From the score. Tampa Bay's gone up by one here in the second period, and I like that jump in their step we're starting to see here now. We've really seen an uptick in their momentum in the last few shifts, and they're rewarded with that goal, James. They've got to continue to attack the net, ski downhill, and not be afraid to get to the paint. Vancouver's got the puck along the wall. The Bulls gain possession in their own end. Here's a chance on the attack. Denied by the goaltender. And he slides it quickly to Chernak. Picked up along the boards by McDonough. And the stick, his best friend on that save right there. The Canucks have had multiple scoring opportunities, but they still trail in the second. And they win the draw in the offensive zone, and they go to work. Long jam in front, that's broken up. DeBrusque's got it across the line. Tampa Bay's got the puck in their own end. The Canucks gain control of the puck. Here he is on the tip. Great save by the goaltender on that one. Tosses it to Hagel. Poked away and forces the turnover at center. And now it's grabbed by Hagel. Big play inside the defensive zone. Hagel's the only save Extend the lead to two here in period number two. Well, and I've liked their complete game tonight, James, all the way from their goaltending right to their defense and then into their offense. They've generated, they've created, they played sound defensively, and now they've got that two-goal lead. Puck scooped up by Garland. Great read with the stick. And he takes the pass. Takes the feed in the middle of the ice. Fires it on now. He just got enough of it. Joshua's got it in the defensive end. Along the half wall with the puck. Grabbed along the board by Joshua. Knocked away. Can't keep a hold of it as he's jostled off the puck. And he slides it quickly to Sorelli. And it's a quick pass to Atkinson. Handles the puck. Scrum ensues along the boards. The Lightning have gained control of the puck along the wall. Pokes it away to stay on the attack. Tampa Bay's looking to break out. And it's kicked away. And some good footwork to kick it away. Gaining momentum along the wing. Vancouver's gained possession along the boards. Good hit to knock the puck loose. With possession along the wall. Moves it to the middle, and he shuts down a great scoring chance there. Tampa Bay's got the puck. Working the puck deep inside their own end. Poked away in the neutral zone by Hoaglander. The Canucks take it along the wall. Takes a bump, but still hangs on to the puck. Sorelli stick handling in his own zone. Demko's been 
been under siege all game long. I mean, his defense is doing nothing to protect him, but one save after another. They're lucky that they're still in this game. They've got to get going north and look to put some numbers up on the other side of the board. Vancouver's got control of it now from their own end. Pinned up along the boards. Taken along the wall by Myers. Taken by Hoaglander. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. To the low spot. He stopped it. Oh, he stopped it. Oh, he's like a rubber band, James. I thought he was out of the net, but he finds his way back in to make that save. And these fans are still buzzing at how well he just saw. What a save that was, Cheryl. Yeah, he made an incredible save and really engaged this fan base. They're on their feet. You know they're right into the game. And listen, when they are showing you that kind of appreciation, you also want to play for them. Vancouver's got the puck along the boards. And now it's grabbed by Pedersen. Musa quickly over to DeBrusque. Fires it! Routine glove stopped by Vasilevsky. And the puck stopper jumps on top of it to get a stoppage in play. We haven't even hit the midway mark of the period. While fans being treated to some offensive fireworks, it's a 5-3 game. Vancouver's won the faceoff. Here's a shot! A timely save is everything to your team, and this goaltender, he bails his team out. The Canucks have time to work with, but they need to convert on one of these scoring chances as they are trailing here in the second. Pedersen's won the draw here in the offensive zone. Redirected off one of his own line mates there. Here's a shot. Scores! And just like that, they take that momentum. No, that's a huge shift. I mean, listen, their opponent scores, and instead of allowing them to build the confidence on it, they stomp it out right away. That's exactly what you want to do if you want to be a competitive team. Oh, is he ever dialed in on that one, James? He's fallen to the ice and still shows his skill set and his puck pursuit as he's able to get a shot off while he's falling. And he executes, and everyone is going nuts. They know what he just did. That's an effort play. The Canucks have jumped right back into this one here in the second with that goal. And you can certainly feel the momentum changing tides right there, James, especially after that goal. They cut the deficit within one. And now he tries to get it across to Paul. Strong defensive effort. DeBrusque's got the puck in his own zone. Vancouver's working the transition through the middle of the ice. Fires it into the offensive zone. The Ports have it now. And now he moves it quickly to SMO. Tampa Bay's got the puck against the boards. Big time stop. Demko is a great goaltender who understands where the threats are. And this one's in the slot area, and he manages to get to position and make the save. Shot! Denies him on the play. Demko's got great rebound control and just pushes that out of harm's way. Handles the puck from the left side. Wow, what a stop by Vasilevsky. And the puck's booted away. Tampa Bay's got a hold of it along the wall. Quick pass over to Chaffee. Picked up along the wall by Glenn Denning. Grabs the puck in the defensive zone. Oh, and he tracks it perfectly in the offensive end. Blocked in front. Vasilevsky's going to hang on for a whistle. Vancouver's put up a lot of shots and so far plenty of scoring chances and yet they still trail here in the second. Slides in off the wing after the centerman tied him up. And that's a great heads up play by Glenn Denning. Poked away by Hironic. The Canucks looking against the half wall. Moves it to the middle. Oh, and he comes up with a stop. Player goes down to the ice. There's the referee's hand in the air. Looks like we got a tripping penalty on the way. Well, the penalty killers are going to have to be the task on this one, protecting that one goal lead. Back to the face-off circle. They'll send the man advantage unit out again. 
Well, they create a power play opportunity with hard work, and now it's an opportunity to get back in this game, James, finding a way to move the puck quickly and create seams to get shots on net. Into the attacking area from the left side. Takes a shot. Close save. Somehow got a piece of it. Moves the puck across to Suter. Feeds it over. Good defensive effort to poke it away. The Bulls will try to shave a few seconds off this penalty now. They move the puck out of harm's way. Oh, and a board rattling hit right there. Well, uh, certainly was lined up perfectly body on body. Weight distributed right in there. Oh, it comes up with a big stop there. Tampa Bay's got a hold of it against the wall. Picks off the feed. Gains the zone through center. Takes the feed. Turns it away. Goaltender spent so much time doing tracking exercises, and it's utilized right here as he knows where this puck is coming from, and he makes the save. Glenn Dennings recognizing they're still shorthanded here as they get ready for the faceoff. Miller's won the faceoff, and now let's see what they can do. Too much traffic in the lane. My goodness, what a save by Vasilevsky. They'll want to clear the zone here while they're trying to kill off this penalty. And they get the puck out of the defensive end. Vancouver's got a hold of the puck now. Moves it to Besser. Gaining speed through center, and here they come on the attack. Takes a shot. Tries to feed it over to Kurgensen. Oh, he'll feel all of that after this one. Moves the puck. Stick save just got a piece of it with that one. Here's the chance to set up now. All sorts of pressure here in the offensive end. He's really coming up a notch now. Trying to get it out. And they get it out of the zone. Vancouver's got possession of the puck. Here they come. And he keeps possession. Oh, and the goalie catches a break there. Traps the puck away. Clearing attempt. From the blue line, they take control of it. This has been slash penalty coming up. And here comes the judgment from the official. And yet another penalty is called, so out comes the PK unit. And you know what? They are taxed. They are worn down. If this continues, it's all going to backfire. The Canucks send their man advantage unit out once more. Man, power plays can be tough when you're not scoring. But it's all about the now. Not disrupting the flow of the game, but giving you energy. Tampa Bay's won the faceoff deep in their own end. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. Here's a shot! Oh, fantastic stop there! Handles the pass. And that pass goes off a stick. Through center along the wing. And that's intercepted. Here's a short pass to Suter. The Bolts gain control of it. Carries it across the line. Out of midair, he swats it down to the ice. And he sends it across to Hoaglander. The Canucks play it up the wing. There's the collision, and look who's hit again. Well, he's been a punching bag tonight, James. He's going to have to find a way to get out of the way. Into the corner of the attacking area. And that's off a stick. Now a quick pass to DeBrest. Here they come, down the right side and on the attack. Here's a shot. Denies him! Sends the pass over. Wax it into the offensive zone. The Canucks gain possession. Vancouver's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Looking to break out here on the power play. Into the offensive end, right up the middle. Broken up by Perks. Slides the puck over. Tampa Bay's got it across the line. Centering feed. And it denies that great opportunity there. Great use of the wall in the pass. Great vision to see that stretch pass. Slides it across. Oh, and he just gets a piece of it to keep it out. 
The shot's come from the middle of the ice, and it has some heat on it, but he's ready and waiting for it. He's to position, and he makes the save. Can they capitalize on this power play? Here comes the faceoff. Vancouver's won the draw. Makes his presence known on the ice. They go on the attack through center. Back to the blue line. Loses his balance on the play. Down the left wing and into the offensive zone. Passes it over. Gets a piece of it to keep it out. The Canucks still trail by a goal as they fail to capitalize on the power play. The next shift is critical, James. They had the opportunity on the power play to get back in it and get the equalizer. Now they're down by one, so they have to manage some energy here, and they have to dictate pace and get back in the game. Scooped up along the wall by Chernak. Atkinson swooping in on the attack. The Canucks gain control of the puck against the wall. Oh, he hammered him. Uh, he knew exactly what he was doing going into this along the boards, James. I love that it was a clean hit. He finishes it off perfectly. And a great save. Oh, what a save there, James. I mean, that's situational awareness at its finest, knowing exactly where the threat is in that slow slot and taking all the space away. Scrum along the boards. The Canucks have it against the wall. Shot off target. Puck picked up by Atkinson. Angles it over to Carlin. Moves the puck into the D zone. The Canucks will play it in their own end. Looking for space inside the D zone. Vancouver's got the puck in their own end. The Canucks move it in. Rocks him on the play. Oh, just a textbook hit. Herbix is taking it from his own end. There's a collision with some authority. And he maintains possession of the puck here. More than half the period has expired. The Bolts are in an offensive battle tonight. They lead it 5-4. Here's a chance. Fires the wrist shot. And he hits one of his own teammates with that shot. Quick pass to Perbix. Through the neutral zone. It goes to the middle. Goes right to the crease. Oh, and he didn't get all of it, but just enough to keep it out of the net. When the puck's in the low slot, the goaltender gets right out next to the shooter and makes the save. Takes it at center. Oh, and he stops that one that was served up with a whole lot of spice. Scoops up the puck now. Quick feed to Kucherov. Takes the feed at the point. Sends it out in front. And he elects not to shoot and will hang on to the puck. The Canucks scoop it up along the boards. Miller's carrying it ahead. Steps in all of that. Dishes it off. Misses. And he works so hard to get to the middle of the ice and to get that scoring chance, and he just blows it wide. And a poke check knocks the puck away. Moves it quickly over to Dayarnay. Right up the gut into the attacking zone. Oh, and he misses on a grade A plus scoring chance there. Well, he's right exactly where he wants to be. He's got the puck on his stick, just unable to put it in the mesh. Goaltender hangs on for the whistle. Vancouver's been active on the shot department, but they continue to trail here late in period number two. Gets a hold of the puck. Loses possession after he takes a little hit. And a stick in the lane to flex something away. Oh, he blocked him! Oh, that's got to feel terrible. James, I mean, he finished his hit right through his check. Moves it to Sheary. Takes it and looks ahead. Puts it on net. And will play on as that gets a piece of the glove. Slides it to Sherwood. And a smart heads-up play to poke out away by Radish. Oh, and that doesn't go well. Here's a short pass to Paul. They gain the offensive zone from the middle. along the wing 
Garland's got it along the wing. Amazing shot. Gives them nothing in front. And that caroms off one of his teammates in front. And that shot dies in traffic. Big time stop there. Feeds it over. Quick pass to Gurdonson. He carries the puck up along the wing. Into the corner now. Takes a bump but hangs on to the puck. Handles the pass on the right side. Quick feed to Susie. I don't think anybody was hanging on to the puck after that hit. From the left side, they gain the zone. And that's broken up in the defensive zone by Susie. Moves it quickly over to DeBrusk. On the attack along the boards. Here's a chance! And he can't find the net. Oh, and I like everything about this play until the finish, James. It's all about creating. That's exactly what happens. And then the puck is looking a little fine as it makes its way towards the net. And it misses. The Canucks have a hold of it in the defensive zone. The Bolts get a hold of the puck along the boards. Broken up with the stick in the defensive end. The Bolts take possession in the neutral zone. Working the puck deep inside their own end. Exploring options here inside the defensive zone. Takes a hit on the play. Tampa Bay is ready to go on the attack. Moves it to Strong. Takes the puck deep inside his own end. Picked up along the boards by Strong. Drives to the paint. Shot. Big save. Vasilevsky's in such great position. He's able to redirect that puck to safety right to the corner. And the home side is nervous. Look at this pressure here in the offensive end. And they finally stop the pressure as they get it out. Beautiful read in the defensive end by Besser. The coach won't be very happy with that play, James. Listen, that's a good way to get your butt glued to the bench, especially when you have a lead. Wicked stop by the goaltender. We got a whistle as the puck goes out of play. Vancouver's had a lot of good looks offensively, but they have run into one hot goaltender, which is why they trail late in this second. And as the puck is dropped, they win the draw here inside the defensive zone. Kucherov's a true sniper, James. Oh! The Bulls extend the lead to two here as they get closer and closer to intermission, Cheryl. Great timing to go up by two. You've dictated the play. You're coming into the end of the second period, and you find a way to get another. Now, right off of this face-off, they really want to set the tone and keep their opponent on their heels. Nearing the 40-minute mark of the game. They gain the zone from the left side. Oh, just a great heads-up play by Gensel. The Bulls played along the boards. Slides the puck down low. Slides it across. And the goalie covers up for the whistle. Both teams gliding into position and the official set to drop the puck. The Canucks win the draw. Tries to get the puck over to Besser. Poked away by Hedman. He looks deep to Kucherov. Directed over to Hedman. Jostling for the puck and he loses control. Here's a short pass to Hedman. The Bolts have it now. Slides the puck into the offensive zone. Vancouver's got a hold of it along the wall. And that's a great heads up play in the offensive zone. Grabbed along the board by Gensel. Back to the point it goes. Stops him with the glove. Well, this is a really great save, James. I mean, you can see that he's battling for position. You can see him moving up and down as his eyes are trying to track and find the puck. That's outworking your opponent and finding a way to make the save. Tampa Bay's 
won the draw. Now let's see what they can do with it. Oh, makes the save. That was a rocket. Forty minutes to play in the books. Both teams will get one last chance to catch their breaths, and then it's on to period number three next. Join us for our next team practice, which will be open to the public. Admission is simply by donation, with all proceeds going to the local charities.
are readying themselves at center ice as the third period is about to go. It's been quite the night of fireworks thus far. Let's see what this third period can do to keep up. Cheryl, 40 minutes in the books now played. Oh, what a chance here! What a save! Oh, my goodness! I thought they had it there off the rush! Vasilevsky's been outstanding, James. I mean, that last sequence was so impressive. I mean, he re-energized his team now as they make their way up the ice. And that's put away by Hironic. Taken along the wall by Gensler. And he gets a glove on it to keep it at bay. Well, that shot came quick, and it was right out front. He had to be sharp. He had to be right on it and show his brilliant reflexes. Officials are set. Players seem ready. We're ready to get this thing back underway. The Canucks win the draw. Hughes picks up the puck. The Lightning have gained possession off the wall. That knocks him off the puck. Demko's opted to hang on to the puck for a faceoff. Nice job tying up his opponent. Through the middle of the ice, they enter the attacking zone. Quick shot! Oh, spectacular stop there! And that's intercepted by Gensler. Moves it to Kucherov. Shot! And that's stopped by Demko. Center into the middle! And that's stopped! Trying to escape the pressure. Oh, making his presence felt with a hit! Great use of the stick in the defensive end by Radish. Works it across to point. Tampa Bay's got the puck along the wall. Fires it on net. Oh, what a save in front. Quick pass to Pedersen. Carries the puck through the neutral zone. Grabs control of it at the point. Stopped by the goaltender. Does a great job with some great pushes to get to the top of his crease and make the save from a high danger area. Hagel's got it on the offensive end. Feeds it over to DeBrusque. Retreats with the puck inside the defensive zone. Vancouver's looking to break out. Shakes off the defender with some nifty moves. Fires it! Oh, what a club save there! I love that he swallowed this one up with his glove. It's a real threat coming from the slot area. No rebound to boot. Tampa Bay's won the draw. The Bolts move the puck in the defensive zone. Great pass from out the right side. Passes it over. And a nice takeaway in the defensive end by Myers. Quick feed to Garland. Great reach with the poke check by Chernak. And now he angles it across to Atkinson. Shot! And that goes off course off a body. Demko's gonna hang on to the puck for a whistle. Puck possession so critical. Another face-off coming up here. The Bolts win that offensive zone face-off. Huge save on the play! Oh my goodness! Whoa. Absolutely incredible that he can extend himself like that, James, to be able to get onto that puck. Incredible save. Hard hit, frees up the puck. Great hand-eye contact on the play. And he was ready for that save. Vancouver's got it in the own zone. Here they come up along the wing. Takes a shot. Oh, it stays out. He got a piece of that one. And he takes the dish. Takes a shot. Denied by Demko. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Puck clears the zone and they'll be forced to regroup. Picked up along the wall by Chernak. Inside his own end moves the puck. 
From the right side, they gain the zone. Skates to the crease. Stuffs it again. Absolutely love this, Abe James. I mean, the shooter's at a point-blank range, right in that low slot, and it's just taken away. Grand Larceny. Tries to get it to Holtlander. The Canucks carry it along the wall. Laying the body. Pushes it across to Sheary. And he takes the feed. Stopped by the goaltender getting a piece of that one. A player should never be left alone in the slot, but man, is the goaltender to task here. Gets out in front of it and makes the save. Handles the puck at the point. Slides it diagonally to Besser. Steps into it. And that shot goes nowhere as the lane was filled. Slides by the check. They score! The Bulls probably don't want this game to end the way things have gone here. I know we're in period number three, but Cheryl, what a night. Yeah, it's been terrific right from puck drop, and they've been consistent throughout the game, and consistency is always a word that coaches talk about. And if they can finish this off with this nice lead, that's the word the coach is going to be preaching after the game. Both sides digging into that puck along the wall. Vancouver's got it in their own zone. And he takes the feed. And he's ridden off the puck. The Canucks ready to go on the attack. Scooped up along the wall by DeBrusk. The Bolts will play it from the defensive zone. Great reach with the poke check. Great feed from the left side. The Canucks cross the blue line and are on the attack. Tampa Bay's got control of it now from their own end. Aims the zone along the right wall. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Snaps it here on the side. He's Tampa Bay's been running away with this one since the beginning of the game, and no signs of slowing down in the third. It's been a productive night, and this is one of those games that gives everyone confidence, and this is important for your lineup as everyone gets it as they feel like they're contributing. Puck grab by Susi. Takes that pass back to the point. Stones him in front. Goaltender covers up. We got a stoppage in play. The Bolts continue to lead big here in this third period. Points wanted in their own end. Chernak's moving the puck through his own zone. And he slides it quickly to Susi. Blocked in traffic. From the point, off a stick. They fight for it along the boards. From behind his own net. Along the wing, up the neutral zone. From the left side, takes it at center. Oh, how did he get a piece of that? And he slides it quickly to Heinen. Change up, change up. And that's poked away. Picked up along the boards by Heinen. And somehow he hangs on. Oh, how did he get a glove on that? What a stop by Vasilevsky. Tampa Bay's been total non-stop action on the offensive end, and they continue to lead in the third. The Canucks win the faceoff. Oh, a clutch save! Feeds the puck across to McDonough. Hagel's got it in the defensive end. Here they come on the attack. Can't get it to go. Slides it on over to Besser. 
Tampa Bay is looking to break out of their own end. And he's knocked off the puck there. Covers it. Oh, what a save on the one-timer. He was dialed in there. Play ready to resume as everybody lines in for the faceoff. Sorelli's won the draw deep in the defensive zone. Picking up momentum across the zone here on the right side. Grabbed along the boards by Fogel. Vancouver's got it along the wall. Connects with a long lead pass here in the middle. Hegel can buzz it. Tampa Bay's offense continues to shine here in this third period. Well, this has got to be a dream for a coach. You know that they're telling their team in the intermission to make sure they stay to business, stay to task, stay focused. And that's exactly what they've done, and they just hammered their opponent. Radish is lugging the puck. Broken up with the stick at the defensive end. Here he is with the backhander. Stopped by the goaltender. Puck scooped up by Garland. Moves it quickly over to Atkinson. And now he moves it to Hedman. And that's knocked away by Thurber. Rocked him in the open ice. Taken along the wall by Thurber. Quick pass across to Garland. Drills him. The Bolt shot line has been so impressive tonight, James. Just the way they feed off one another, their motion, their chemistry. Real tough to defend and create a lot of momentum for their team. No room for that one to get through. But he's really got them on their heels here now. Let's get the call. Well, the refs are calling a really tight game, and man, this has been a parade to the penalty box, and the entire bench looks agitated, and as a result, they keep taking more. Vancouver's power play unit puts their hard hats on as they go back to work. Well, James, the power play has been brutal tonight, but you have to find a way to get your personnel activated. And a lot goes back to the bench here. The coach has to settle them down and work on that confidence. Dishes it to DeBrusque. Moves it to Suter. Here's a shot. Oh, he got all of that. What a save by Vasilevsky. I really like the save, James, because he challenges the shooter who's all alone in the slot area. He turns aside a real dangerous opportunity. Glenn Denning's ready for the draws that will continue to try to kill off this penalty. Oh, and he takes possession of the puck. Scores! And they finally stop the bleeding and answer back. Well, it ain't over yet. Anytime you can claw your way back into a game, and there's time on the clock. There's an opportunity to answer. I love the patience of this power play. It's all about puck movement. And when you're going to let a shot go, you want to make sure that there's traffic net front. And that's exactly what happens. The goaltender screen, and they find the back of the net. Vancouver's fan base watching, streaming, taking this one in wherever, probably wondering, where was this earlier? Yeah, it's frustrating for an athlete when you know what you can play like, you know what your team can play like, you just don't perform. But late in the game here, they need goals. They need a pile of them if they even want to have an opportunity to get their tender out of the net. And he comes up big with the stick save, getting all of it with the paddle. What a save. I mean, how quick do you have to be to be able to get on that puck, James? Anytime it's in the low slot, you've got to be on your toes, and that's exactly what he was to be able to make the save. Vancouver's going to start with the puck in their own end. Passes on over to Hoaglander. The Canucks take it along the wall. Still has possession. And it's a quick pass to Susie. Unloads from the blue line. And that goes off a player in front. And now it's over to Hagel. 
Vancouver's got control of the puck. Can hang on to the puck after taking a knock. The Canucks gain control of the puck. Through the neutral zone and into the offensive end. Here's a shot, and he shuts the door on that. Vasilevsky's got the puck and hangs on for a whistle here in this third period. Well, he's been one of their best players all night. A reason why they're leading here in the third, James. But it's not just about the save. It's about managing the puck and making the decisions when to hold on. The Canucks take possession off the faceoff. And he had the answer on that one. Picked up along the wall by Gensel. Vancouver's got the puck. And now it's grabbed by Point. Gessel's moving it ahead. Moves it around along the half wall. Dishes it off. Snaps it on net. Fantastic save. And the puck's knocked loose. Vancouver's in transition. Here's a short pass to Strong. Shot. Gets in front of it for the block. And kept that one out of the net. All those tracking exercises when you're young come in handy when you're old. And this is a prime example. Look at him, Bob and Weave, trying to find that puck. He does and makes a save. Shakes off the coverage. Receives the pass. And that goes off a body. And down he goes as the puck goes free. Quick pass to DeBrus. Nice hit on the play there. Hammers a shot. And that's broken up. Oh, and he somehow got a little piece of it. That's fierce athleticism to be able to get back to the net and make that save, James. That was amazing. They put the puck into the offensive end. Esimont's got the puck in his own zone. Sherry's crossed the line and gained the zone. Makes the save. He scores! There's the goaltender to come into James the team is not playing well in front of you the starter's been chased out of the crease and then you get peppered right away real tough the Bulls continue to attack the net here in period number three adding yet another goal to their score well it's been all areas of the game that have really been terrific tonight James have also enjoyed the communication that we're seeing on the ice not just the body language, but also the vocalness. I mean, and they're creating all over the ice, and it's been real fun to watch. Pumped off the puck. Quick feed to Garland. Here they come through center and into the offensive end. With the stop. Covers it up, and we'll get a stoppage in play. Centers are set. Face off ready to resume play. The Bulls start with the puck in their own end. Pushes it across to Gergensen's. And now he moves it quickly to Glenn Denning. On man rush. Takes a bump but hangs on. The Canucks' body language says it all, James. I mean, they're not happy with their performance, and you can certainly tell by the looks of everyone, their faces and their body language, that they aren't happy. And that's broken up. Feeds it over. Vancouver's got a hold of the puck. Slides it quickly to Myers. Moves the puck into the attacking area. And that's blocked away. The Lightning have the puck in their own end. Sends it deep inside the offensive zone. The Lightning have possession along the boards. Tampa Bay is playing it from the side. Unable to reach that one. Goaltender gave him nothing as it goes off the side of the net. Rips it. Oh, it stops him again. Scooped up along the wall by Myers. Takes the pass. Now a quick pass to Hoaglander. Takes the feed. And the puck clears the zone. They'll be forced to leave as well. And he slides it quickly to Hoaglander. From the point, they take control of it. 
The Canucks looking against the half wall. Big save by the goaltender. And we get a whistle as the goaltender decides to hang on to this one. The Canucks win the draw and they go on the attack here in the offensive zone. Into the offensive zone. Shot! Oh, he stopped it! What a save on the play! And there's nothing technical about that. That is all about the will to find a way to make that save incredible, James. Official signals for the players to get into position and we're about ready to drop the puck. The Bolts will go to work here in the offensive zone. Taken by Hagel. off the 1-3-1 sequence that they were successful on earlier, James. It really opens up the ice. So you're using and stretching the entire zone. And listen, there's a lot of ice for the defense to cover. So you can look to the flank, you can look to the bumper, but a lot of options off of it. And they move the puck out of harm's way. Sends a pass over. Great pass from the left wing up the middle now. Good, solid check, and he loses control of it. Vasilevsky's going to give everyone a chance to breathe and hang on to the puck. Power play set to roll on as the setters get ready for the faceoff. The Bolts win the draw here at their own end. Trying to get out of the defensive end. And they clear the zone, and that'll shave some time off. A great sequence by the PK unit. Really aggressive, close quickly on the puck, and they get it down the ice. Tampa Bay is going to be able to kill a few seconds off now with the puck. And they clear that puck. Slides the puck ahead to Besser. Oh, he'll feel that one. Turn it aside with the glove by Vasilevsky. Sliding in for the face-off as this penalty kill will continue. The Canucks win the draw. Now let's see what they can do with it. Makes a move in front. Oh, puts it wide. And oh, no, he'll want that one back. Well, you can see the frustration right there. I think there was a sense of urgency, but he had more time than he thought. And they managed to clear it. Vancouver's got the puck along the boards. Moves it quickly over to DeBrusque. Puck picked up by Suter. Shuts him down. There's the whistle. We'll get a face-off after the goalie covers up. Another face-off looming here on this power play. Suter's won the draw, and they're on the attack. Tries to feed it over to Point. Picking up ahead of steam on the breakaway. Brings it off the iron. Well, he knew what he was going to do coming in one-on-one -on -one with the goaltender. Looks real confident in it, but man, he just missed by inches. That one's unlucky. It hits the post and comes out. Tampa Bay's got the puck shorthanded. Trying to clear the zone. And the puck is cleared. Well, you can see the entire PK unit. Their heads are on a swivel, straight line skating, and they're able to get that puck. And because they're looking and aware, they're able to find the white ice and get it 200 feet down. Vancouver's got the puck along the wall. And that's just out of reach. Oh, you might call that friendly fire as it goes off one of his teammates. And time expires on the power play. Both teams back to even. When you're feeling it, you're feeling it, James. And that's another effective PK. You don't get much better than that. And it's all about read and reacting. They did an excellent job. The Bolts come up with the defensive zone draw. Moves the puck over to Atkinson. Picked up along the boards by Chernak. Solid check to slow him down. 
Oh, great move to sidestep the check. Slides it across. The Bolts grab possession to the puck. They try to maintain possession inside the defensive zone. Angles it over to Hagel. Tampa Bay's got the puck against the half wall. A little crashing and banging forces the turnover. Vancouver's going on the attack as they gain the zone. Here's a chance! Oh, and that's a piece of it with the glove! Puck is frozen and we'll get a face-off. Vancouver's got to be frustrated with how things have played out tonight, trailing in this third period. The Canucks take possession here inside the offensive zone. Tampa Bay's got the puck in the defensive end. Knocked around, but keeps it going. Moves it to Myers. And he slides it quickly to Garland. Once again. Well, he's a target now, James, because he's got a lack of spatial awareness. You gotta keep your head up if you want to play this game and be safe in it. And that pass attempt is deflected. Good hit. Into the offensive end now. Moves the puck to Garland. Tampa Bay's gained possession along the boards. And it's stopped by the glove. Nice play there. What an incredible glove saved by the goaltender. I mean, he gets out to the top of the crease. He's challenging. He's saying, hey, try and beat me on this side. The Canucks coaching staff has to be frustrated. Their players have played well tonight, but they just can't finish on some of these chances, and we're running out of time late in the third. Puck grab by Pedersen. Rocks him. DeBrusk slowed down with the hook, and the official's arm is in the air. This is a frustrating situation, James. Just taking a whack load of penalties and really unable to get any momentum in this game because they're shorthanded the whole time. The Canucks once again send out their power play unit. Well, they've already scored tonight on the PP, James, and looking to really thread the needle again on this one. Their movement, their adjustments have been excellent thus far. Slides in off the wing after the centerman tied him up. Puck clears the zone. Vancouver's got a hold of it against the wall. Through center. Sends it across. Quick shot. Oh, what a save by Vasilevsky. What a fantastic save from a high-danger scoring area, James. And, I mean, he's bailing his team out. They have to do a better job of protecting the middle of the ice. Vasilevsky's got the puck, and he's going to hang on. Miller's ready for the draw as we get set to resume this power play. Glenn Dennings won the draw inside his own end. And they get the puck out. Can't hang on to the biscuit after that. Moves it up through the middle from the right. And he feeds it down to Miller. And he takes the pass. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Here in the corner, he grabs the puck. Pass back to the point. Scores! And the power play comes up big again. I love the various options that they have on their power play James once the PK adjusts to one they hit the other well this is just a great job to get the hands away from the body and deflect that puck into the net as it changes direction goaltender doesn't have a chance The Canucks are starting to show a little respectability here amongst themselves as they get one back. Yeah, and it's about mojo. It's how you end the game with good habits because you want to make sure that you don't carry the beginning of the game into your next one. Puck scooped up by Horonic. Went for the dirty dangle and it goes sideways. Fesser's so difficult to stop in tight and he's got magic hands, but unfortunately this time it doesn't go his way as he tries to get a little nifty. Sometimes simple is the best way to go. The Bolts have it behind the cage. Couldn't catch up to that pass. Here's a shot. Gets in front of it. There's the whistle as the puck stopper elects to hang on. The Canucks need to find a way to convert one here late as they trail in the third. Off 
off the draw, they take possession. Hughes takes it inside his own end. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Besser. And that one's denied. Takes a hit, he goes down to the ice and toss off the puck. Here's a short pass to Point. Oh, look at this chance. Shot, and that goes off a stick. Grabs the puck in the corner. Passes it over. That's some smart heads up defensive play by Strong. Rocks him into the boards. Great defensive play to come up with the puck. Both teams are set. They're ready to drop the puck. And with the centers tied up, he swoops in to take possession. Keeps possession. And it's a quick pass to Kucherov. Gaining speed through center, and here they come on the attack. but every single time he's got pinpoint accuracy and delivers right to his teammate's stick. The Bulls are sending a clear message that they are not taking their foot off the gas in this third period here, Cheryl. Well, you can certainly tell that they bought into the game plan, and the coach is certainly ecstatic with the performance of the entire bench. I mean, look at the way they're moving and holding the puck, attacking the net at the right times. It has been a seamless effort. Continue to bring up the score here in period number three. Well, it's just been a terrific collective effort. Now they're on the home stretch, and the coaching staff has a real opportunity to utilize their bench, rest their star players, and this is critical when you're in a long season. Now over to Shiri. Quick pass to Paul. Poked away at center by Pedersen. Fires it on net and makes the save. Goaltender covers it up. We get a whistle to slow things down. Vancouver's time is running out in this one to try to even things up. They've had plenty of scoring chances, but no finish tonight. And now it's grabbed by Myers. We'll get a face-off after the puck stays covered up. Teams are ready to go, and we're about moments away from puck drop. Vancouver's got it in the offensive zone. Here's a shot. Too much congestion in front. Carries it into the offensive end up the middle. The Canucks will play it in their own end. Suters gain the line and on the attack. Chance in front. And he shuts down a great scoring chance there. The Bolts get a hold of the puck in their own end. Works it across to Susie. And that's turned aside by Vasilevsky. Quick pass to Asimov. Pass across to Paul. Tampa Bay's through center and now in the offensive end. Fires it. And that's blocked. Takes a lock but still hangs on. Miller's got it from behind his own net. Moves the puck into the attacking area. The Lightning have it in their own zone. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. Shot! Turned aside with a glove. In front of the net, and the goaltender covers up for a whistle on the play.
The Canucks win the draw on their own end. Looking for space inside the D zone. And as we hit the final minute of this one, that has been a one-sided affair. Vancouver's had more shots on goal, but yet they've run into a hot goalie, and they trail late in this third period. And they win the offensive zone face-off. Now let's see if they can capitalize. There's the whistle as the puck is frozen up. Centers are lined up, and we are ready to resume. Good read by the winger as the two centers tie up. There's a shot, and he makes the save. Taken by Hagel. Gain momentum up along the side. Handles the puck. Can't keep a hold of it. Dished on over to Hoaglander. Here they come on the attack. Oh, and here's the pass. Along the half wall with the puck. And the traffic neutralizes that threat. Vancouver's got possession of the puck. Sends it deep inside the offensive zone. And now he moves it quickly to Kucherov. And as the final seconds kick off the clock, the Hope fans acknowledging what they just saw tonight. Vancouver's got the puck after winning the defensive zone faceoff. Headman pass. Big save. that you see between the fan base and their team and it's a tradition right you come out on the ice and you want to salute them and say thank you for providing energy throughout the game hope you had as much fun as we did bringing you the action here from all of us at ea sports i'm james sabalski peace